Alright guys, I'm back, coming at you with another episode of Digimon World. In the last episode, we were all over the place, fighting. And now I'm back, I'm wearing my Digimon Christ of Courage t-shirt, and I'm ready. I mean business today, folks. So, in the last episode, as I said, we were all just going all over the place, and we did in fact recruit Ninjamon. Ninjamon is now down here at the secret item shop, we can speak to him. And we're about items, there are 128 kinds of items in all. 32 are food, rare items grow naturally in some areas and can't be found in others. For example, you can find a blue apple in native forest. These foods have special effects, so be careful on the timing of eating them. Right, so he's quite handy, he just kind of tells us about stuff. Um, I can't remember if he does anything else, he might, I'm not too sure to be honest, because some of these guys, we're getting, to the, we're getting to the part now where I'm losing a bit of my information. I know so much about the beginning of this game, but... As it kind of turns on, I, I, my information teeters off a little bit and I become a bit of a noob. Oh, here we see Metal Greymon needing some food, as always. Um, oh, now here we can see that these bloody guys are back again because Ninjamon has been defeated. But we're going to feed him quickly because we need that done. I've made a completely noob mistake here guys, I've left these chips in my inventory and I have also not collected today's meat. So I'm going to do that rubbish right quickly and I'll meet you back here in a minute. See you then. Guys we have just returned back to the item shop and as you can see here Piximon's now here. Hi, I'm busy all the time, running the shop. Nah, I'm kind of lazy and I won't be in the shop much but I got some cool stuff. Yes, training manual. With this, your training will be better. It's very valuable. I'll sell it to you for 50,000 50, 50, 50, bits! You'll regret not buying it. So this is an extremely useful item. It's called a training manual. Basically when you're training, it just makes everything easier. It speeds up the process. But it's very dear. There's no way we can afford it right now. Uh, better get selling some sirloin because we want that bloody training manual and we want it right now. So I'll have to do a bit of grinding off camera, I guess, for that, but as of now, we are heading to the promised land of the virus exclusive place I have been talking about in the past couple of episodes. Um, yeah, we're going to head there today. It's a brand new area. I'm really excited for it because it's a pretty cool area. It's pretty unique. It's not just the kind of wide open plain with Digimon to recruit that most areas tend to be. It's, it's, it's quite, quite a good area. Quite a good area. It's one of the two places, as I said before, one of the two places that you can only go to if you're a certain type. But we are, in fact, a virus type. Oh, an orange banana. Ooh, a banana. Yeah, we are virus type, so we will be able to go to this dark, terrific, terrifying, tantalizingly scary place. It's quite good. I do like it. If I do say so myself, it's quite a good place. It's up here. It's just off the side of the jungle. I don't think I've ever shown you this before, but let's go in. The Overdale. Oh man, listen to that scary ass song and the scary ass did you I've actually seen these guys before, but there are, it's a recolouring of them. And they seem to be here just guarding this place. Oh, can Are they just gonna let me in? Of course not, but I managed to sneakily sneak past them anyway. Good stuff. Fucking hell, this music's pretty atmospheric and spooky five me. Too spooky five me even. And as we see over here, there is a little guy. His name's Bakemon. But if we speak to him, if we speak, hey, backy, backy. Looks like he's asking something. Eh, the fucking I don't know. You're just saying backy, backy. Maybe I don't really, don't really know what he's saying. But here, you can choose yes or no. He does actually ask you questions. But the only way for you to tell what he's saying is if you have a Bakemon of your own. Um, but I I don't know the combination. I believe it's like no, no it's not. No, I've bobbed it already. Fuck. Maybe I made him mad. Well, he's gone, but we can recruit him again later. So we'll definitely do that once I remember what it is I'm supposed to say. And we're into Grey Lord's mansion here. This is the area you can't come to if you're virus. Listen to that cool ass music. Oh, but we've got a wee cutscene here.
just giving us a pan and show at the place, it's a pretty big area. What a big mansion! Anybody home? No one's home and they can't hear me. Alright, start exploring. So, we just kind of get dropped into this mansion and we get told to explore. Um, it's really, it's quite a confusing area. When I was wee it used to confuse the hell out of me because you're just kind of... It's like Resident Evil, you know, you're just walking about locked doors everywhere, don't really know what to do. I've got a general idea of what I'm doing here, but most of this is playing it by ear. Here we go. Door slams open. And I think this is the kitchen. Oh, there's a toilet in here. Good, we will need that. Did I get an... Oh my god, we've got no autopilot and no toilets. Right, this is going to be fun, guys. Are you, are you ready for this? Because I know I'm not. And we've got Soma on here. They look like Bakemon, but they've got a wee hat on. And we've got a Sirloin for free. Pretty good. Not so good now that we get free a day. Can we go this way? We can. Oh, there's just more PCs here. Pretty sure we have to fight. Oh, an autopilot. Come on, portable party, portable party. Omni disc shit. Well, an autopilot will be pretty handy. I'm pretty sure we have to go fight these Solmon, but as I've said before. Oh, was that? There's a shiny shine shine under that fireplace. Oh! Put the key. Maybe it'll open some of the doors. So you get a mansion key here, which is an item that you can actually lose, and it kind of buggers you quite a bit. But if you remember that weird shop that sold the cards from earlier, you can actually use, you can actually get it back there because they sell some stuff. If you lose your stuff in a battle, then they sell it. But we're gonna go back and fight those Solmon because I'm pretty sure those guys are the key to unlocking what's going on here in the Grey Lord's mansion. Right, I'm just gonna, I don't think they're too hard a fight, but we may as well check here what moves we've got, just so we don't balls up. Power cream, pulse laser. I think we're gonna put delete program on, just for the, just for the banter. I'll handle you! And one shits he sell, he runs away because we're the same type as him. Pretty good. And there's only two of us to fight, but we're in a really enclosed space here, which is never good for big metal game on here because a lot of these attacks are long cast times. Oh he's going for the ones and the zeros. Oh I hit both of them there. It seems to be the ones and the zeros seem to be really good here. And it's transforming both of them. That's amazing. The value is Hearthstone players would say. I've been getting really into Hearthstone recently. I've always loved card games. I do love that animation though. It's pretty cool. Oh, and we get interrupted though. That's the only thing I was struggling with this attack. It's very... Animation is ridiculously low. But it's damaging as heck. Oh, come on now, Greymon. You've... You were doing so well, laddie. And now you've only went and ruined it, haven't you? You've only went and ruined it and you've went and got paralysed. That's my... That's, that's like my kind of stereotypical Scottish, I guess. I guess you could see. Oh, we bit uh we bit of a repeat there. Yeah, indeed. And they only give us a thousand bits, but I think there's something to do with the story. What a funny noise. Are these guys even anything to do with the story? It doesn't look like it, it looks like I've just made a mistake. And he's hungry again, Chris. We'll feed him before we go to the toilet. Because I have this theory that there's a kind of shit meter if you like, and as you feed them, it makes them more likely to go to the toilet. Like if you don't feed them, I'm pretty, it's just kind of basic biology. Into it. If you're don't, if you're not eating, you're not going to be able to go to the toilet. But it's a game, obviously, so I'm not expecting this to be 100% accurate. But I do feel like that's what it's like. So if I ever, if he's ever hungry and needs the toilet at the same time, I always feed him first because I feel like feeding them will increase the shit meter, quote unquote. And when you go to the toilet, that empties the shit meter. Um, I did see a freezer in here. I'm pretty sure that's relevant. Relevant. I'm pretty sure that's relevant to something. It's a refrigerator. It's locked. I must write. So we need a key for that. And the Soulmon are back. 
proving once again that I have messed up and they are not a fight you need to do. Pretty good though I guess, it was kind of fun. Oh right, so we can go in here with the mansion key now. Continue exploring. So we've got a little Sukaimon here, little Patamon look-alike. I'm just gonna head right on past him, head up the stairs. And we're in some sort of creepy ass lab. What's this? MP chip? Awesome, right? I was just making sure that's a chip. <sighs> Even though it did say a chip, I had to make sure. Come on, I don't want to fight these guys. They look weird as hell though, they're like Frigimon, but they're not kind of finished. They're like, I don't know, they're weird. Can we get in this? Hey, oi oi, autopilot. Another autopilot, we've got two now. I'm pretty sure this gives way, does it? What? Ah, it gave way, who expected that? Me. That's who. Oh, and that hurt this time. What kind of place is this? Looks like we entered a room we've never seen before, been to it before. Right, so, I'm gonna heal him up right quickly. Oh, I want to use that, but it's just wasting it really, isn't it? Only this boosts all skills and path. These are all good items, I guess. Only this is pretty, pretty pointless because it's far more money. Like it's worth for far more money than it is by selling it than it is to use in battle. So we'll probably end up selling that if we, if we hold on here, we might end up having to use it in a big fight. But we're back to full HP here. Oh, and there's another computer behind here. This is just full of stuff. That's amazing. We don't really need that. We'd just be selling it, and we've got Saint Aragon in the city. And we don't plan on getting sick anytime soon anyway. Metal Greymon's a fighting machine, he can take the illness. We've got a coffin in here, it looks oddly suspicious, let's try and interact with this. Here it is! Here what is, what are you talking about? How did you know there was an elevator? An es is that an elevator? It's probably an elevator, but this takes us down here. And we see a guy collapsed. Let's have a speak to him. Someone came to help me! Digimon, are you okay? Who are you? Give me food! Hungry, what do you want? Meat! I got meat. Meat! What? Here. A key? I gotta get rid of something. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. Right. Uh, drop the various. I got a fridge key. Okay. I don't have much time. I'll bring something soon and hang on a lot more. Look at this creepy ass Digimon up here though. This statue's mental, I don't even know what it is. In all my vast Digimon knowledge, I do not know what Digimon that is. I'm not even sure if it is a Digimon that they use. Ever again. Because, I mean, I've seen most of the seasons of the, the older Digimon, I've seen some of the new one, and I do not know who the heck that is. But we got given that fridge key for the fridge I was looking at earlier on. I knew there was something to do with a fridge. I knew it. So we're gonna head over there. Where the heck are we? Bookland again. I feel like there's something in this to do. That's a locked door. Will the knob open? Ah, it opened right, so it's a one way open. Where will we end up? Main room, I think. No, we end up up the stairs. Hell, this place is disorientating as heck. Can we even go out here? It looks like you can, it looks like a balcony or something, but I don't think you can. And this is a upstairs is actually a different room. If I remember correctly, if we go out here though. We need to go out here and No, it's not here yet. But we can go talk to Bakamon again, because I don't want to recruit him obviously. Right, back a back, it looks like it's asking. Yes! Right, yep, but we're, <laughs> we're getting it now. Backy, 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 no! Ah, fuck, I bobbed it. Right, well, <laughs> I messed up again. Um, we'll just kind of do that. Just playing that by ear, I guess. We'll, we'll keep doing that every time we come out. Right, but we are back in the mansion. Gonna head over to the fridge. Use the mansion key. This isn't the right place at all. Oh no, it's the right place we can go up here. Awesome. Ah, right. 
back to this fridge. Hopefully it will have some meat for that Digimon we found. He's actually called Myotismon. It's not really a spoiler, I guess. It's his fucking name, you know. It's not, it's no, it's not a big bit of information. Use the refrigerator key. What have we got going on here? I don't see it. There's a memo. Return to the position where you got the points from the dumb one. I should listen to this memo. Right. Oh, I accidentally spoke to you again. No, no I keep... I always do this. It's like in Pokemon where you're sitting trying to speak to Nurse Joy and you just tap the button because you want it, you want out. But then you accidentally hit it again and you have to talk to her all over again. Ah, first world problems. So, I'm um, pretty sure it's like, go speak to my Otis mon. Pretty sure that's what it means. But we're going to go back outside again. Speak to Bakemon. Because we need to recruit him. I'm pretty sure we can re Yeah, I'm a, in fact, I'm 100% sure we can recruit him. Not pretty sure. There seems to be meat lying on the floor here. Oh, I'm off space as well. Fucking ace. Sirloin. I'm pretty sure that's... Yeah, look, it's a weird sirloin. It's got, like, blood on it. Clearly made for a vampire. But let's quickly speak to Bakemon. What is he doing? Backy backy? Looks like he's asking something. I say yes, right? Yep, he likes that. And then this means we say yes again. Backy. Backy backy. Pretty sure it's gonna be no. No! <laughs> backy backy! Backy backy backy! And then he flies away. Oh, he joined the city, right? I thought he got angry. I think it went okay, right? So, <laughs> he does in fact join the city. We completely guessed that, but I guess what there. But, we got it. We got him in the end. He joined the city, which is exactly what we wanted. So, I think we're going to head back to my Otis one now. We got that bloody meat. Uh, I think you're supposed to go and speak to my Otis one again and he says something like, oh no, they've put trick they're playing tricks on me or some pish like that. But, we, I, I've played this before, I kind of, I've got a kind of a bit familiar with it, you know, so I just went and grabbed the meat for the outside, saved us a bit of time, made this a bit slicker. But we can head back down here again, speak to my Otis Mon, and we will give him the meat and hopefully restore his strength. Phew! I'm saved! Thanks so much. Sorry for the trouble. What happened? I'm Myotismon, master of this mansion. I'm Chuk, a human from another world. This is my partner Gabba. We're here to save the island. Looks like we have lot to talk about. I welcome you. This is kinda just, it looks like he's sitting but he's not sitting on anything. I think that's because you don't actually see him standing. He's sitting down here if I'm right. Yep, he's sitting down. So, they were really lazy and they didn't. They decided not to fucking model him standing up. He's sitting down and he's standing up model because they didn't want to model, model him twice. Or put an animation in or something. Ah, please listen. Please listen up. Yummy, yummy. So he's getting us a meal here. My men don't listen anymore. I don't think they can remember my orders. Sometimes they don't even understand. My men should bring my meals, but... Yummy! Yummy! While I was working, they didn't bring my meals, so I forgot to eat like the idiot bastard I am. I forgot to eat because my, my minions weren't there to feed me. You are too wrapped up in your work. I'm so embarrassed. Well, that's fucking pretty, pretty big thing to be embarrassed about. I forgot to eat because I was too busy in my lab. I think there's trouble in the mansion. Problem on the island? Is everyone acting like my men? Yes, they're all losing their memory. Do you think someone's doing this? Ha ha ha! Hmm. What can I do? We're building a city to unite Digimon's hearts. We're travelling to find friends. What can I do? My men have only fighting skills. Want to enter a match? A match? It's perfect. It will refresh my men. So you want to join? Yes, but I still have research to do here. I'll go there soon. So, fucking, I don't really know what the heck we do here now. I think we're, I think we're good. Um, 
put, put a couple of air quotations there, I think we're good. Because I'm not really too sure, I'm pretty sure I have to come back. The matches have helped my men, matches good break from my research. What's the research about? Right, so, I fucking, I don't know. We might be finished here. Um, in fact, guys, I'm quickly gonna double check that we are finished here because I don't want us wasting time and having to come back here later. It wastes my time, it wastes yours, it's not good. Let's just get this out of the way. Right now, I'll be back in a second. Back in another second. Guys, we are in fact done with Greylord's Mansion. So, I think we are going to call it an episode here, guys. I'm going to feed Metal Graham on a tasty wee autopilot, and we are going to go up the road, up the road, and I will see you next time, guys. Thank you so much for watching. You've been fantastic, as always. I'll see you in the next one, guys. Oh, here's Andromon again. Oh, wait, wait. Anyway, outro. Hi, guys. I'm away. I'll see you later. Goodbye.